You have to throw that shoulder to disrupt your uh, opponent. So, boom. So see right there, you didn't even hit me hard. You actually move a shift in my body weight. All right, because I'm going now, and it's just boom. All right, the, the way I'm standing, I'm like this. It gets me from this side, throws my foot over, and it just naturally goes, right? Because that's a natural motion anyways that we used to pivot. All right, so anyhow, so that's why, believe it or not, you step in with that spark and shove. All right, and then right there, you skip over with both feet. All right, you over exaggerated right there, but that's the overall motion. Let's go a little bit normal now. So, ha, ha. You see, and I threw the, 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 we'll do it from right here. I threw the jab straight, simple combination. And I actually followed him. I actually followed him uh, because I was following his head. I went, bam, and I knew his head was going. And, and I'm knowing that he's going like that. So I tried to literally aim at his head. And he was way under it. And then he bumped me, I was way over, and I was more worried about getting my foot and getting my guard back, but by that time he's already striking me. I had to strike from this angle, all right? So see, he went fast on all those, all right? And he didn't even move fast, but he was tap, 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 tap. All right, it's quick sh uh, shots, and they're, they're powerful shots, even though he's not expanding out, you know, any, anywhere near above 65, those are like 35, 40% shots. All right, that, and he, so what does that mean? That he's hitting me good, um, good spots, vulnerable spots, and he's not even, he's basically preserving himself. He's not even exerting his energy and stuff like that. Um, anyhow, so now uh, we're gonna show you southpaw real fast. Uh, let's see, so I'll be the southpaw. We will, uh, it's the same thing for southpaw, but I'm just gonna demonstrate it real quick. I'm not gonna drill it like I was as a, uh, showing, demonstrating with Steve being the, the, the orthodox. All right, so um, you stand in southpaw, and I'll be an orthodox right now. Um, actually, no, I'm supposed to be southpaw. All right, so uh, are you southpaw right now? Mm -hmm. Yeah, all right. So now I'm going to show you southpaw against southpaw. All right, so again, you wanna, uh, you're going to go towards e either side. Obviously, we're going to start right now uh, going the normal, the normal way that uh, orthodox like, um, tend to go which is that uh, step over and then come over this way. But I'm gonna do what we were showing earlier so we can skip over by, go ahead and throw it straight. So I step over and then I come over right here, up, down, all right? Uh, go on this side. All right, so in case he's throwing a lead hand left, all right, uh, southpaw, I guess a southpaw, he's throwing a lead hand left, throw the lead hand left, boom. So see, again, I spar shoved in, and I basically use the same angle. I shift about here and do it again, about this way, like that. Uh, yeah, so watch the trajectory that he does with that natural overhand uh, left. Go ahead. So see, I followed that same trajectory he was going. I just followed right along with it. I skirt that arm, all right? So anyhow, go this way again. So I go slow. So remember, it's a step. All right, so see, I shifted my entire body. Right now, you can't even see my body, so my body is basically dead center in front of his. So when he throws that straight, I'm going, I'm stepping, and I'm sliding the rear foot. Now, right here, this is where I can boom, 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 boom. Sorry, it's a little hard. All right, so, um, and those up-down combinations, you'd be surprised. These boom, 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 they don't take much energy because you're naturally, uh, go over, scoot over, uh, scoot over. Uh, so, no, scoot over. Um, so, uh, so uh, when you do that up down, so you come over, so you're just shifting your body weight around, all right? So when you come over, bam, boom, 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 boom. You're just shifting your body weight around, making yourself a difficult target. And you're doing all those shots that hit pretty hard, um, at least, you know, uh, four times as hard, you know, than a jab without you even trying hard and way above, depending on how much uh, centrifugal force Inertia, gravity, all that you take into your advantage uh, and take advantage of. I mean, uh, anyhow, so the last one, uh, let's see to the opposite side. So, southpaw, southpaw. So, this time, this is where it's a little bit difficult for a southpaw. All right, so go ahead and throw the jab. Uh, you're going to step over, and then from here, I'm going to come over. All right, bam, bam. All right, I can do that jab straight. All right, um, let's go this time. So, same thing, you're going to step over, bam. That's all you're doing. All right, keeping this foot in the place. Ooh. All right, one more time. Boom, boom. And then right here, uh, I overdid it actually. I'm now uh, as an orthodox. Sorry about that. All right, so go ahead. Boom, bam. Now right here, I'm still as orthodox as ha, ha, I can come over. 
with all that power. Uh, this side again, one more time on that side. So I step over, oh sorry, wrong side. <laughs> all right, I step over like that, and that's all I do, all right? So basically, you're just stepping over, side crunching to that side, boom. That way that, that, that what is it, jab? Yeah. yeah, the jab comes over, and then right here, you're just shifting your shoulder back. That's it. So you're not really sleeping too much, all right, but now, I'm pointing at him, so start over again right here one last time. All right, so I'm shifting over, and then boom. And now I'm pointing to his center. Bam, bam. Anything right here, all right, I can come. Um, uh, what else, what else? All right, I think that's it, right? Oh, as a, as a, as now I go as an orthodox. All right, so now let's talk about against orthodox. All right, um, so go ahead and throw the jab. Same thing, everything else is the same. This time, I'm going to shift over, bam, bam, all right? Or right here, I can shift his body weight, he's going to come over, boom, and then right there, I can hit him, all right? Uh, it's all about disrupting the center of gravity. Uh, go on this side as a uh, orthodox again, all right? So, boom, everything is the same. Everything else is still the same, all right? Bam, 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 all right? Uh, what else, what else? Uh, oh, yeah, and then the opposite side, so say like that. So now, this is where it's a little bit risky, uh, for a southpaw to do it against uh, orthodox, all right? For some reason, the other way around is not too risky. Um, so anyhow, so let's stand on this side. So why? Because I'm going towards his power in an opposite, in an awkward motion. So basically, I gotta bait him. I gotta make him react. I gotta make him try to counter with that uh, uh, uncareful, you know, hey, making lead hand right or something like uh, Mayweather likes to use. All right, so, you know, I got a pro jab, pro jab, and then make, uh, control the distance, go this way. All right, pro jab, and then control the distance so that, you know, I can make him think that I'm coming in, and then he's going to try to shoot that, but I'm just going in, back, all right. He throws it, so in, back, and then right here, come over. Bam, huge uppercut. I'm still in a softball position, all right. Do it again on this side. All right, so, so I just step over, come over, bam, anything here. And again, it, uh, it, all you're doing is, like I said, orthodox against orthodox, I mean southpaw against southpaw, are you just stepping over, boom, that's it, and then bam, bam. Same exact thing. All right, but the point is, is you got to bait them. Uh, you can't just do it. You can't, all the other ones, you can literally just initiate the motion, and they're going to react to you. Either, you know, as long as you keep that guard, trust me, they're going to swing, yes, they're going to contact your guards, yes, but they're going to uh, exert energy, and then they don't know what they're doing, you let them exert energy, oxygen, with all those shots that they're throwing at your guard, all right, and then pop shot, pop shot, take more energy, uh, ex oxygen out, and then go for the kill, all right, when you got the chance, all right. Anyhow, sorry for that really long uh, tutorial. My name is Jesus Medina. I'm the creator of KO Method, which is a holistic approach to fitness and self-defense training. I'm also the owner of Seabreeze Fitness. We're located in Costa Mesa, California, so we're not recording this. Uh, and I want to give thanks here to Warrior Steven. The next video is going to show how we drew this uh, with Warrior Demir uh, for a few seconds. That way he can finish off his training for tonight. And don't forget, you're limited to your creativity. Pain is temporary. Pride is eternal. Fulfillment lasts forever. All right, the fight will be worth it. As long as it's not a broken bone, keep fighting through the fatigue, through hey, all those inner demons. Don't let them slow you down, all right? Don't let them tell you to eat that freaking burger, eat that hot dog. Hell no. Stay away from that stuff. That, that, that stuff is so bad. Uh, Kill method, baby, knocking out the competition.